Phil Cohen here, Cohen on content at the Digital Signage Expo in beautiful sunny Las Vegas. I feel bad for you if you're not here because you're probably digging out from the snow. I got Kim Sarubi. <laughs> Again. Again, like for 20 years, but what? We'll, we'll come up with something new to talk about. Kimberly. Yes. Kimberly Marie. Yes. I, you are now the incoming chairman of the Digital Signage Chairwoman. Federation. Chairwoman. Chairperson <laughs> of the Digital Signage Federation. Yes. And I'm the outgoing. I'm kicking him out. And now I'm emeritus. Now I'm the old guy sitting at the end of the table being quiet. Yes. Uh, no, never being That's quiet. That's not going to happen. Never being quiet. Kim, you've been here. You've been speaking. You've been at a few of the sessions. You've had some meetings. Yes. What's your impression of the show so far? She's going to say good things, but I'm going to try to get no, her to tell us what? what's really going on. Well, the show continues to grow. The quality of the people here continues to get better. Um, I Wait, know you mean the people we had here last year were no good? Not no, better? I'm just, you know, when I speak and the, the people are coming at, up to me after I speak, I mean, these are huge company names. Uh, I won't name them, but, you know, hi, I'm from, and you're going, yeah. wow. You know, I would have never thought five years ago that these are the caliber of people that would be coming to the, the show. Of companies. The caliber of companies is definitely, and they're looking at the show seriously and they're sending not one, but multiple people to the show. So that means they're serious about a digital signage solution. They're serious about learning what they need to know and doing it right. Um, and in fact, one of the, the companies I spoke to, big box retailer um, in clothing, and you know they're just saying, hey, we we have tried this before and we failed, and then we tried it again and we failed. Yes. So we really need to. We understood that we didn't come and get the information first, and we need to do that now. We need to do it right. And there's two parts going on. You have the CEO that's saying, I want a return on investment, and you have the CMO that's going, well, it's not always about the return on investment. It's about customer experience, about many things. I must be the CEO. Yes. Although I spent my life as a creative, yes, I, but I want to return on investment too. Well, and so that was my point. It's a way to how do they measure it to right. determine what they return? Right, is. that's a, a great point because what what is success for that particular company? So you know you you need to learn, and and I think what was happening a few years ago is that maybe people were going to just pure technology shows, looking at the technology, buying the technology, installing the technology and then going okay what do we do now yeah the the i, I think that there was a, a disconnect between the technology side and the creative side yes i think that they the technology side said okay what's the content and we all know how that can be misconstrued oh we push this key that key and right. you know we have our content but now they're re realizing they're recognizing the amount of creativity that goes in to developing this content. Wow. I, I've seen a bunch of the new board members as well as almost all of the old board members around. Your new committee seem to be working pretty hard and getting some stuff done. Well, that's another change for Digital Science Federation that a lot of those big name companies are ending up on our board now, on our committees. They're committed to helping this industry grow. And although in years past, it's been a lot of us in our little group and we all knew each other. Um, we're having people step up that are going, I want to be involved, I want to help, how do I do that? And they're bringing big corporations behind them that have resources, that have research, that have information that helps us all grow. So that's going to be a huge plus for the Digital Science Federation this year. All right. I'll take the, uh, the pat on the back that last year we had a whole bunch of new initiatives. Um, and then I'll add to that pat on the back that says, almost none of them my idea. <laughs> it came from you, it came from Ken Goldberg, it came from Brian Ducho, it came from uh, uh, Jack, um, 
I always want to say Jack Armstrong. <laughs> Sullivan. Sullivan. And everybody participated. Right. And we came up with a bunch of good stuff. I think these regional things right. have become a real monster. Well, and I think also being able for the board, for us to meet in person every quarter and just really talk about it and having experiences and what we just installed and what went well and what didn't, yeah. what's working, what's not, it really helps. It's been a lot of fun today listening to uh, retailers, to uh, uh, banks and bankers. Yeah. Uh, had some had some really good conversations. Listen, I'm doing my um, survey. Uh oh. In the past, it's been a one-man survey. Now I'm actually asking other people to survey. There's a lot of magazines, newsletters, electronic newsletters, what have you. Is there anything? And if so, can you name? And if not, just say so that you read on a regular basis, whether it's daily, weekly, monthly, whether you like it or you don't like it, that you actually read it. Yes, there's a couple that I read. Uh, Digital Signage Today and The Daily Do, I get both in my box. Okay. But I do like to read magazines that are just on the peripheral of what we do but are touching on digital signage because I like to see what other people are doing and from the angles of what they're doing. So like communication and sound or even AV ma magazines where you could see that they're starting to get into this business. Yeah. And um, even um, I, I get another uh, blog, it's a Content Marketing Institute. And that's on, you know, not really in the digital science space either, but that gives us ideas from a marketing standpoint okay. how they're going about it. So, you know, I'm constantly reading and um, you never know when uh, you're going to get a good idea and from where. You never know when you're going to get a good idea and from where. Geez, that could be a bumper sticker. Come here. Look at <laughs> We're that. shaking hands. A handshake with Kimberly Maurice. <laughs> All right, I'll see you later. Okay. See you later, too. You'll see me later. Goodbye.